The Michael is now Respite Center is in their 19th year of operation and hosted their 19th annual Michael's Run. I am the one of the founders, one of the two founders of the Respite Center, and um, I am one of the directors um, at the Respite Center. Right. And I'm also Michael's mom. The afternoon featured the 5K as well as many activities for all ages. Today was our 19th annual Michael's Run, and it is um, has a lot of value in many different ways. One is the, it honors my son Michael, who passed away when he was 10 years old, who the Respite Center is named after. It's also a race that our Respite Center um, individuals train for all summer long, so they get their trophies for months of worth of work. Um, it's also a wonderful community event. Um, as you can see, the Hopkinton um, football team comes out and they walk with and run with our runners. So it's a, it's a real event of inclusion and um, just a happy event. The annual Michael's Run received big support from the community once again. Oh, today went just wonderfully well. It was, the weather was gorgeous, the colors are beautiful. Um, we had a nice turnout. The Hopkinton Running Club did all the registrations for us. It just could not have been a better day. All right, and is there uh, any more events uh, coming up for the Respite, Respite Center? Center? Um, our next big events come um, at marathon time. So we're, we're kind of quiet from now through marathon time, but um, the Boston Marathon's our biggest fundraising event of the year. All right, excellent. And uh, if someone wanted to learn more about the uh, Respite Center, where could they go? You can go online to hopkintonrespite.com and visit our website, and all the information is on there.